Makai and Tini. Oh, it's across uh, the left hand, a pretty good pace as well. 148 k's per hour or 92 miles per hour. That's quick and it's the perfect line and length to a left hander. Seam up and it makes pace off the pitch. Stephen Fleming is uh, left aghast. As so is uh, Mark Boucher. That races past and rattles into his gloves very quickly indeed. Thought about having a dabble. Another good uh, delivery. Almost 150 k's per hour, that one from a Tenney. 149, so he's got some pace today. Well, if you're going to hit, you might as well throw the bat at this sort of thing because if it hits the edge, it's going to fly. Man, it's going to fly at that pace. And that dip too on Mark Boucher at the last second was quite an awkward take. Some uh, connection with the willow, so uh, gets himself down the other end. Does the skipper? up. But, uh, well, the area that is covered by the two slips, they generally get fairly close. New Zealand were a lot more space than that when they were in the field this morning. So that uh, was on him before he realised. Leg by. Well, they say the only place to find form is out in the middle, and that's where McMillan is. And uh, Sean Pollock will mosey on in the third slip. There we go. But just have a look how close they are. They are uh, staggered, of course. But, uh, New Zealand were using two slips just about to cover that space this morning. That's the breakthrough as they try and do uh, something adventurous against him. Oh, that's a great delivery. That really is a beauty. That is a terrific over from a Karen Another quick ball, just two runs from it. 16 for no loss.